YouTube. What's up everyone? Welcome back guys to my channel The Masculine Legacy and in this video we're going to be talking about that why you need to stop obsessing over a woman's body, why you need to stop uh, uh, falling over a woman's looks, right? So in this video, we're going to be deep diving into this topic. So if you like the topic of this video, then please make sure that you hit that like button, you share this video, comment on your views in the comment section and please subscribe to my channel if you have not done yet and press that notification bell icon right next to the subscribe button so that whenever I upload a video, you guys get a notification of it. So without any further delay, let's jump into the video. So these days, these days what I am noticing that most of the guys most of the young men are basically wasting so much of their potential, so much of their money, energy, attention and time for women by getting physically attracted to them. And a lot of, lot of you guys are following semi-nude Instagram models, paying to these OnlyFans bitches and basically uh, inflating their ego just because the way they look, just because they are beautiful, just because they are so-called hot, sexy or something like that. And I just want to say you guys very quickly and straightforwardly that this whole beauty, this whole uh, hotness, this whole sexiness is nothing but just a mere illusion. It's an illusion in your mind, guys. Understand that. And I want you to understand this very deeply and firmly that Whatever you are thinking is beautiful or something like that is nothing but a trick of your mind. It's a planned game against you. It's your biology playing with your mind. Your hormones playing with your mind. Your hormones are hijacking your intelligence, your consciousness. And how, and how does this happen? You see, whenever you see a woman you are automatically triggered because you know men are evolutionary triggered visually we men we as men get triggered by uh, a woman's beauty a woman's physical uh, gestures physical characteristics and that is why men we as men like bigger boobs or bigger busts or bigger asses or something like that or, or curvy body and all these kind of wider hips these all are the things which have been ingrained into our DNA right from the uh, Stone Age times when we used to roam in the jungles. Because as they say that women with wider hips are more fertile and all these kind of things, all these biological logic, you see. But the thing is, your biology is playing with your brain. When you see a woman, you find her physically attractive, it's not that she's some some uh, some goddess or something but it's you value her just based on a fact that she is beautiful or sure she is physically attractive because here your hormones are tricking your brain into thinking that that particular woman is attractive and this is what is happening on a psychological level this is what is happening on a subconscious level and you need to understand this and this is why when you see uh, like in today's time, uh, this is why plastic surgery industry, this is why uh, beauty industry, cosmetic industry, this whole fake hair extensions and eyelashes and uh, makeup brands and uh, fake nails and fake boobs and fake asses and God knows what. These, these things, these industry are multi-billion dollar industries. Because they, women, women know that as men, our weakness is phys their, their physical attractiveness. We are visual creatures as men. Women are visual creatures too. But men are more visual than women. And due to this fact, uh, whole the, these whole industries are making money. These whole industries are minting out money. Uh, out of just our pure biological desire and this is why women uh, wear makeup this is why they, they 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 use fake hair extensions this is why they use uh, hula hoops in their 
e e earrings or something like that or long fake nails and this is why they invest hundreds and hundreds of dollars into on, on the body and on their outfits or uh, butt lifters or botox injections or something like that and they always and always try to look as much as attractive as they can because they know that as men we are visual creatures and we are vi drawn towards physically attractive women and that's our weakness as a man and that's what we need to conquer when we are, are on semen retention when you are practicing semen retention you need to understand this fact that women are not some goddess women are not some you know, someone whom you should worship they are just normal human beings so you need to understand you need to hardwire this fact inside your brain that women are not some special body women are just like normal human beings treat them as normal human beings don't fall for a woman's beauty because as they say in bible that bodies are not attractive bodies are not uh, bodies are not something to be worshiped off because bodies are mortal we all come and die we all grow old we, we uh, a handsome man will not always look handsome and a beautiful woman a young attractive lady won't look attractive in her 60s or in her 70s when her when her uh, hairs will grow gray and her skin will be full of wrinkles and her boobs will be saggy and all these kind of things so body is mortal but the soul is immortal and that is why all the religions say that a real woman a real beautiful woman is a woman who has a kind heart who has a noble soul not an attractive body because you my dear friends you are not this body and as a man you are also not this body you and this is why i always say that semen retention is not something physical don't do semen retention just for a uh, female attraction or just for increased confidence or just for physical benefits do semen retention for spiritual benefits because semen retention has spiritual benefits the real thing is that semen retention will transform your spiritual journey on onto a next level that you will realize you will realize this sooner or later that you are not this body you are not this mortal body this 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 being you are something else you you will feel that connection that genuine connection and this is why when you are on semen retention you need to understand that bodies are not attractive souls are attractive and i'm going to repeat this bodies are not attractive souls are attractive and if you need to realize realize this very um, like further then i will just give you an example like take any kind any any beautiful women you know any any celebrity any any girl you know or anyone uh, uh, your your crush or your girlfriend or maybe your partner i want you to go beyond the skin like human body this 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 skin layer i want you to think what a woman what a woman's body looks like beyond this skin like inside this skin if you remove this skin from a woman's face or from for from a woman's body what kind of body what what like what you will see <clears throat> you will see a very ugly representation because you know what this whole skin it's it's this whole skin is tricking you this whole glowing skin and this uh attractive curves and you know what these nipples and these all kind of things these are tricking you into thinking that a woman is beautiful if you just remove if you just simply remove the skin of a woman and you just imagine what kind of uh, like what kind of image you will see once you remove the skin of a woman and you will see flesh red colored flesh red colored blood veins uh, bones and uh, all kind of urine and stool if you if you just take when you are attracted to the navel the the midriff part of a woman next time you get attracted to a woman's midriff or a woman's navel navel or stomach or her, her belly or her stomach just imagine that what what's beyond this layer of skin and you will instantly come to your senses that just just behind just behind this skin layer there's urine there's stool 
a woman pisses a woman takes pisses uh, uh, a woman goes to pee a woman goes to washroom a woman farts uh, uh, she takes she she, she discharges uh, blood from her vagina monthly and you see and you will realize that this mortal body and here i'm not disrespecting any woman with due respect i respect women but all i'm saying is that a woman is just like a normal person whatever you are thinking is just a game of this skin and this superficial attractiveness which media which pornography or which uh, uh, society has projected on you the real beauty ladies and gentlemen is inside the spirit of a person not on the outer level not on the superficial level you get it and back to the point when i was saying that uh, uh, imagine what's beyond the skin and you will realize that beyond the skin human body is so fucking ugly that you can't even see it but once it is been covered by a layer of skin and suddenly you are tempted to believe that a woman's body is attractive just imagine what's behind her breast it's a piece of flesh ladies and gentlemen you can't even see it it's dirty it's full of blood you see what's inside her vagina it's it's urine it's, it's fucking ugly how you can how you can get attracted how you can get tempted by that ladies and gentlemen what's inside her anus it's a stool it's a waste and you as a man working wasting all of your potential all of your masculine essence by jerking off to a woman by thinking that uh, she is attractive and this is why when you ejaculate this is why when you jerk off and you come then you come to your senses and this is what i we call as post nut clarity and this is why when you ejaculate you come to your senses that uh, all this attraction and all this your horniness and all all your sexual frustration which 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 built up inside you is vanished like this and you are now now you are back to your senses now you are thinking like what i was watching like if you if if you jerk off by seeing to porn you have noticed you might have noticed this that after once you jerk off once you are finished with your task then many times like most of the times you will realize that what you have been watching was gross it was it was ugly so laid like fellas i just want to tell you that don't don't ever think into uh, what media is projecting you all these rappers talking their thanks and all these only fans girls and talking their booties and shaking their cleavages all the day boobies and all these kind of things i don't know what I'm, what i'm saying but you know what i'm saying all these things which they are selling on social media all these things uh which are which are making you believe that a woman is attractive <laughs> the next time you get attracted to a woman just think in your brain that she is just a normal person like you she goes to the toilet she discharges urine she discharges blood she discharges stool she farts she smells she sweats she is just like a normal person like you and she will die too and probably one day she will look more and more uglier as she will age so don't let your biology fool you guys don't let your uh, your 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 hormones your very basic animal primitive instinct take away your intelligence and consciousness and rule over your rationality be a real man be a real man be a man of god don't 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 follow these mortal bodies don't chase these mortal bodies chase the upliftment of your spirit and with this i want to rest my voice and i hope that you like my message if you like my message then please make sure that you hit that like button you share this video and you comment down your views on this video or whatever next videos you want me to cover in the comment section subscribe and press the notification bell icon until next time signing off goodbye god bless you